Good afternoon. I am Renee Bauer. I'm one of the registered dietitians here at Carson Tahoe Regional Hospital. Um, I'm here to answer some really intriguing and fun questions about nutrition. Um, this will be ongoing, so feel free to send some questions, more questions. Uh, the first question, what's the best way to incorporate more protein into breakfast? Well, there's lots of ways. One of the ways I do, I add peanut butter to my oatmeal. Actually, almond butter, too. Um, another way, you can add uh, nuts. You can add <laughs> anything you want. And, um, protein at breakfast is really nice because it keeps you full, keeps your blood sugar stable till you eat again. Um, scramble an egg. If you have high cholesterol, um, egg substitute. There's many ways. Even if you're on a run, make a smoothie. Use the Greek yogurt. Uh, it, what they've done is taken out some of the fluid and it's more concentrated in protein. Uh, the next question. Just started juicing. I have a protein shake as soon as I get up. Fruit juice when I'm done working out. Then one to two green juice drinks and a handful of nuts in the afternoon. I have a normal dinner. Is this a safe way to get more nutrients and lose some weight? Well, first of all, I really like that you're doing more fruits. And the juicer they have nowadays, um, it doesn't take out the fiber, so that's really good. Um, one of the concerns I have about um, juicing, though, and just using it from a lot of your meals, is you might not be full. So just be careful at dinner if you're not eating too much and compensating for the lack of calories um, that you may have missed on those other meals. General, um, if you don't have time, you might juice in the morning and maybe have something else with that meal and the same goes for um, lunch. Um, but good job on the juicing. Uh, you know, as far as losing weight, again, see how it goes, but generally liquids pass really quick and then you're just hungry for more food and you might be compensating. Okay, well thank you for your question. And don't forget we have four lecture series this month for National Nutrition Month. Um, each one is on a Tuesday and a Thursday for two consecutive weeks. And you can look up our ad in the Sunday paper. Thank you. Is that good?